thank you, thank you, thank you, Sacramento, for finally letting the market, <laughs> oh, for finally letting the markets go, for finally doing something right, Sacramento, for the first time in like four years, just stuck in a circle trying to make something happen for the markets, man. You guys couldn't even put a team around the man, so you finally just got rid of him, and now you get, now you got assets. You got a bunch of new players. You got you got first and second round picks. You got assets, man. And you already know this draft is packed. So what you need to do, Sacramento, now, now that you made a great move, get you another superstar and don't mess it up this time. All right? You did you did a good job by letting the markets go because I don't know how many coaches and, and, and bad GMs or whatnot y'all went through to try and make something happen, but nothing was working, man. Y'all was just going in circles. Thank you for finally just scratching it and starting over. To start this was a great this Sacramento won this trade. Sacramento won this trade. All right, you probably don't think about it like that, but they won this trade in, in their own Sacramento type of way. But let's talk about the New Orleans Pelicans. All right, now the New Orleans Pelicans they got Demarcus Cousins. They got Demarcus Cousins. They now have Demarcus Cousins and Anthony Davis, the greatest, the <laughs> the greatest front court in NBA history. Okay, history. I don't know. Yes, yes. Better than Parison and McHale. Better than Hakeem Olajuwon and and Samson and Dave Robinson and Tim Duncan. These guys shoot threes, defend the rim. They steal the ball. They can handle the rock. Now, for the Pelicans, they're kind of thin on the wing now because they let quite a few wing guard guys go. But I'm sure they got a backup plan for that. I'm sure they got a backup plan for that. All right. Uh, Pelicans won't go in there just just get rid of everything just for Demarcus. Thank you, Pelicans, for pulling the trigger before Boston did. Boston, I know you. Boston, I know you're probably going after Jimmy Butler. You got a chance now. Anything can happen. Do y'all think this was a good or bad trade? Let me know. I think it's amazing. Subscribe. Thanks for watching. I'm out. Duh.